We're continuing our series on how to restore a four track reel to reel tape machine. And here we go with the next step. Okay, well, we're going to start now. Here's our trusty Q tips here, of course, our head and the lubricant. And that's what we're going to start with doing right now. Okay, again, we're going to use the same process as we did with cleaning. We're going to be using this and we just dip it in. We just dip it into here and we dab a little bit. It turns kind of blue and then we go across the heads like in this matter here. I basically just go up and down and around the heads and again, you're only doing the heads this time. See if I can get a little bit to the side shot. There you go. And I'm going just over the head very slowly, very methodically and over the tape path here and here and then over the erase head and over this tape path there. Other than that, I really don't do too much in terms of the capstan or anything like that. I don't put that lubricant because we want that to grab a hold of the tape. This minimizes the tape catching on anything, slowing down or changing speed. The whole consistent thing is to keep the tape going at a very consistent speed. And that's the head lubricant. Join us next time.